Hey y'all, this is Jesse Williams with the Southern Backwoods Oracle coming to you for that weekly card reading. Last week, the reading was the fairy ring reversed. It was a warning not to get pulled in, specifically probably from emotions. It never ceases to amaze me how with these cards, I think it's going to go one way in my head. And then once I go through the week, I see it play out in a completely different way, a helpful way. Last week, that warning ended up turning out really great. Hope it turned out great on y'all's end. So let's see what this week will hold. So for this week, the energy that we should be moving into, the guidance that we should be looking towards, the energy that we should be tapping into this week is the faint trail reversed. So the idea of the faint trail comes from my own wanderings as a child going through the fields. Sometimes we would go off on these random cow trails, going through fields, wandering, going up towards the fence line. And every once in a while you'd see like a faint trail, either going through the fence line, going through the woods, maybe it's a deer path, trails in the woods. Sometimes you could follow them and they would lead somewhere. Other times they would not. And when the faint trail comes up in a reading, it's showing that we're finding a small trail that's actually proving to be beneficial, that is leading us to somewhere. When it's reversed, it's more of a sign of not being afraid to jump the trail, walk away from the trail, to say this is not leading somewhere. So if you're running down this trail and you're noticing it's actually getting fainter and fainter and fainter, it's okay. That's what it is. You don't have to stick to that trail. Sometimes you can go bushwhacking, go stomping through the forest, pushing through the briars. Make your own path. Don't commit yourself to having to stick to a trail if it's just feeling fainter and fainter and getting more and more vague and more difficult to follow. So your challenge for this week, allow yourself to walk away from the trail that you're on if you feel like it's not proving beneficial. Maybe this week, maybe this is somewhat of a calling to check in, check in with yourself. See, is this trail that I'm on actually leading me somewhere? Maybe it is. Maybe it's not. If it's not, hop off the trail. Decide to go a different way. Don't box yourself in to sticking on a trail that's not proving to be an actual path. If it doesn't feel like a path, then it's not a path. That's the energy to bring in this week. So good luck adventuring this week. Bushwhack if you have to, and I hope everyone finds a path that feels in alignment for their soul. Y'all have a good one, and I'll see you next time.